There are a couple of different ways to subtract objects from each other, but the easiest way to do it would be using a mass channel based on a specific surface. So if I have surfaces that are specific to the red channel, and then specific to this white channel, there are a couple of different things I can do. If I want to subtract the white objects from the red objects, I will use a mask channel that's specific to this white surface. And so if I go into my surface after it's finished being created and then select the edit tab, I'll then select mask all. And I'm going to use my red channel as the channel that I'm interested in. And then I'll go down here to the mask settings and I'm going to set the voxel intensity inside the surface to zero and uncheck the box for the setting the voxel intensity outside the surface. What this is going to do is it's going to create a new channel that's based on the red channel, but inside of these white surfaces, the pixel values for the red channel are going to be equal to zero. They'll be the fully dark pixels. The red channel pixels outside of the surfaces will be left alone and they'll be their same values that they were originally. And that's because this box is unchecked. I'll then hit OK and a new channel will be made here. I can then recolor this one to be yellow so we can take a look at how it's different from the original channel data. And if I go back into this white surface and then use the slicer, you can see that inside these surfaces that are outlined in white, there's red pixel information here for our original channel that was unaffected, but there is not the yellow pixel information that you see outside of it. Those yellow pixels are equal to zero when they're inside of this surface. I can then use this new mask surface to then create the surface that I'm interested in for whatever my analysis pur purposes are. So there's not a way of subtracting objects from each other, but you can create new channels that are missing that object information for whatever channel you're interested in to then create new objects. Please let me know if you have any questions. Thanks.